Hi, I'm Charlie Carter from Exhibition News, and here are some of our stories you may have missed this week. First up, the Terrorism Protection of Premises Bill was one of 40 legislative priorities outlined by the new Labour government in the King's speech on the 17th of July. It includes a range of measures aimed at protecting the public from terrorist attacks at live events and venues, including the two tiers of venues which are laid out in the draft bill, standard and enhanced. Secondly, industry stalwarts Alison Balshaw and Penny Banks have joined forces to launch an exhibition services company offering floor plan design solutions. The collaborators will provide custom layouts to enhance show functionality and aesthetics, concept solutions incorporating the latest trends and technologies, flow strategies to ensure every square foot of event space is used effectively, plus personalised consultations. The Event Supplier and Services Association has launched two carbon calculators and an inaugural mentoring programme. The first ESSA calculator enables members to determine the carbon footprint of their entire business. The second focuses on calculating the carbon footprint of individual projects. Director Andrew Harrison said, Our mission has always been to provide members with all the resources necessary to achieve accreditation and to continuously measure their daily activities to ensure alignment with their sustainability goals. And finally, the world travel market has appointed communications agency Davis Tanner to help grow its footprint and reputation. The RX organised show takes place from the 5th to the 7th of November at XL London. Davies Tanner has been awarded a two-year contract following a competitive tender process. The account will be led by Client Services Director Becca Krug and Senior Account Director Evie Kennedy. And that's all from me this week, and as always, click the links to find out more.